You know, you've probably seen these in commercial parking lots, but more and more people in Toronto are installing these bollards in their driveway to prevent auto theft. Brady Wilson owns a concrete company. We do a lot of commercial floor finishing, foundations, excavation, demolition. But another service he offers... We also install bollards. ...is keeping him quite busy these days. One call after the next. These are bollards, steel posts. In the past, Brady's installed these for specific clients. Right. Commercial purposes only, okay. and now they put into play for homeowners. To have them installed in driveways in response to a surge in auto thefts. So these can prevent auto theft? Absolutely, 100%. There are several types, removable, turning the key, lifting the plate, and removing the bollard. And foldable. Slightly lift the bollard, fold it down. In a circumstance like this, great for pickup trucks, SUVs, uh, crossovers. They're not cheap. Average cost of installation in the thousands of dollars. But as vehicle theft skyrocketed in Toronto, up nearly 40% from last year, people are desperate. Just due to the recent like vehicle thefts and thefts of property, thefts of trailers uh, and that sort of nature, people are trying to protect their, their assets. The Toronto Police 53 Division tweeted out this photo promoting a Toronto home which had them installed. Reaction was mixed. Lots of likes, but also lots of questions. No, it's that's... interesting that this is what they expect people to do as like the result like this is the only answer they have I'm not something I could afford Toronto police declined our request for an interview emailing us several tips instead on how to prevent vehicle theft interestingly bollards was not among them they're just informing the public they can't protect everybody a city spokesperson told us bollards are legal to install but Brady says make sure they fall on your property line not the city's you cannot place these on the city property and you cannot place these on your neighboring property the bollard boom Good for Brady's business, maybe, but he's not celebrating. It's terrible how the society has turned that way, where now you're, you're protecting every asset. Nothing is safe. Everything's in the open. As always, if you have an issue, story, or question you'd like us to look into, reach out to us by visiting the Speaker's Corner tab on the City News website. Pat Taney, City News.